I'm David with Bresser Optics. What we'd like to go through today is our Bresser LR800 laser rangefinder. It's a 4x21, three barrel laser rangefinder. Accommodates a nine volt battery that's included with the unit. We're gonna start off by showing you the insertion of the battery. Make sure that the prongs are on the right side. The unit's labeled on the inside, positive and negative. Make sure your battery's inserted right. Close your battery door. The unit's now ready to operate. Each unit comes equipped with an eyepiece cover. It's a two button design. Your first button being the mode of operation which will switch between yards and meters. Your first button closest to your eye is gonna be your on off power switch and also your activation for your laser. What we have a lot of inquiry about is to why we have a two button system. It makes it easier. It does have an auto off feature. So until you actually see the circle inside the reticle, then the unit is off. What you'll do is you'll place the unit to your eye. You'll turn the unit on with a slight depression of the button that's closest to your eye. You'll find inside of it a circular type reticle with three bars and either a Y for yardage or an M for meters up at the top. Once you find this, place the circle over the target that you wish to acquire a yardage for. Press and release the button immediately and your yardage should appear on the screen. If at any point in time the unit actually turns off while you're in the middle of ranging something, Go ahead and touch the unit to turn it on. The circle will reappear back in the, the target acquired zone and depress and release the button immediately for your yardage. Hold the unit as still as you can while you're ranging because the laser will be emitted from the rangefinder and return to the rangefinder in an almost instantaneous manner. If you run into something that gives you a three flashing bars or a flashing number, more than likely it's hit something in between the target and your acquired rangefinder or it's actually bounced off something closer. If you don't acquire the range that you think is the target is at, just feel free to go ahead and elevate it just a little bit, touch and release it again, and it should be fine. If you ever have any problem, the way to reset the unit is to simply pull the battery out, let it set for approximately five seconds, return the battery or a fresh battery to the battery compartment, reinstall, turn the unit on, and you're ready to go once more. The Bresser LR800 laser rangefinder, an 800 yard rangefinder that's equipped for every time of day.